What's up, cross country nation? More miles, more smiles, am I right? Anyways, I've been reading up on an issue, and a lot of non binary women cut their tits off. I have to say, it's an act of unnatural performance enhancement. I'm not trying to be mean. But I'm sure someone would run a hell of a lot faster if they had a pair of double A's than some big ass melons. You know what I mean? It's nothing against women or pronoun using people. But I know for sure that I'd run a hell of a lot slower if I had a pair of dumbbells strapped to my chest that I had to lug around. What's to stop every other girl from saying they identify as non-binary so that they can cut off the parts that hindered their performance and Take a shot of testosterone before every race. I'm not transphobic. I'm just saying this issue is a slippery slope. And the entire integrity of cross country is on the line here. Someone's got to say it. Shut up. Yes? It's Matthew. From Freshman Bio with Dr. Kelly. Matthew, right. Okay. Um, it's, it's, it's been a minute. How are you doing? Uh, pretty good. Yeah, I was building a robot for class. Um, I, I dropped my robot on the way out, though, and it broke. So I, I can't go to nationals. I'm so sorry. I, that's awful. I can't imagine not being able to go to nationals. That must suck. It does. This is pretty awkward. Uh, but I had the biggest crush on you in, in that class. Really? Yeah. Um, but I was like, there's no way that a girl like that would go out with a guy like me. So I, I didn't ask you out. But, uh... I guess this is me asking you out. Um, cool. Yeah, no, I, I would love that. Awesome. I, I had a crush on you too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, and I use they, them pronouns, by the way, so you know, not a girl. Um. Um, so are you, are you free this weekend? Ring, ring. Oh, what was that? Oh, no. oh, I think. Ring, ring. Oh, I think. Oh, I, I'm so sorry. I have to take this. I don't think that. I have to. Oh, I'll call you. I'll call you. you. This phone Ma call's real. Oh, yeah. Matthew. You, yeah. Hello? Ma Ma you, Hello? You know my number, Matthew. <laughs> Tough luck. You know. Dating can be hard, even for a guy like me. But, I just want you to know, even before the whole gender change, I've never seen you as a girl. Thank you. I wasn't trying, I wasn't complimenting you. Why the long face? What? Look up, two o'clock. 
<laughs> what are you guys doing here? We're only an hour away. You act like we can't <laughs> surprise you. <laughs> now, how's my little girl doing? <laughs> Walker is playing favorites. I'm gonna have to have a word with your school. It's fine, Mom. No, it's not fine. You've been taken out of the race for no justifiable reason. This is the kind of crap I had to deal with back in my day. Successful and ambitious women should be treated better now. Just drop it. It's fine. I'm sorry. It's just that a lot has been happening recently that you guys don't know about. Well then talk to us, sweetheart. You've been so distant recently. What's going on? Chloe, you must know something about what's going on. And if our own daughter is not gonna tell us, you will, right? Mm-hmm. I totally would. Um, but I Oh, can't. leave the poor girl alone, dear. <laughs> No, yeah, sorry, I totally would. I just have a lot of homework. Um, can we sit down, please? Everything okay? Yeah. I mean, no, not really. The reason I didn't compete last race is because there's become a bit of a, a conflict of interest, I guess you could say. Hey, if you're struggling with classes, that's okay. College is hard, and you're a student athlete, not an athlete student. No, no, it's not that. What is it then? Uh, boy trouble? God, no, definitely not that either. I'm non-binary. Oh. I don't get it. I, I don't know how to explain it exactly. Um, growing up, I always hated being called a tomboy, but I also knew I didn't want to be a boy either. I guess I just felt sort of lost and like there was something wrong with me. But, but then I got here and I finally found the language to describe how I felt my entire life. It, it just makes sense, you know? Make sense. It actually sounds completely made up. Mom! I just... You know, when I was your age, we had to fight tooth and nail for any respect, yeah, especially in athletics. Women were never taken seriously. You have sponsorships and scholarships and opportunities that girls never had. Yeah, I still have Why would you want to throw that all away? You know, all I'm trying to say is cross country is a big part of the reason why you chose this school. And if you're not gonna be doing that anymore, maybe you need to think about going somewhere else. But I like it here. And running cross country and being non-binary aren't mutually exclusive. I think back me up, you're an English teacher. You're supposed to be cool with this kind of thing. Of course I am. It's just a little different when it's your kid. You've always been my little girl, and now all of a sudden, you're not. Why does everybody keep saying that? This is who I've always been. Is it? Really? What am I supposed to call you now, when I'm bragging about you to my students? 
You're just my kid? Not my daughter? Yes! What is so hard about that? Okay, you know what? You're clearly getting upset. I think that we need to go. That's it? Morgan, what more do you want me to say? That you support me! We do support you! We will always support you. Really? Because it kind of sounds like those are just empty words. I'll be waiting in the car. Why don't you try to go about business as usual with the team? And we can discuss this more over winter break. Whatever. I mean, like, come on. I'm talking racks. Just to get 13 seconds on your milestone? Like, why? Why? You have God's gift. And you go from two double Ds to some batteries. Like, come on. It's just, it's just a waste. It's a waste. It's despicable. All right. Not about that. Not about that. So Elon Musk bought Twitter recently. Gotta say that's probably one of the best decisions like I've ever seen in my life, like business wise. Like, come on, he's. Do you see that man? He's already at the top. All this money, all this fame. He's got a kid named Random Letter. Like he's got it going for him. I'm trying to follow in his footsteps. So I, yeah, I bought Dogecoin. Sure, I I may have lost two hundred dollars when it dropped. But his vision?